starting to fail. Presented at the earliest in the Vietnam War, since the Vietnam-France War period, the M24 Chaffee is considered one of the first American tanks used on the Vietnam battlefield. These tanks were American aid to France, weighing only 18 tons, and the thickest armor was only 38 mm with a 75 mm main gun. The armor and firepower of this tank were only average. Despite poor armor protection, the Americans and the French believed that the Viet Minh army would not be able to confront these light tanks. They could not have expected that. With only primitive weapons, the Vietnamese caused these war machines to fail. The M24 Chaffee was a light tank made by the United States from 1944 to 1953 and entered service during World War II. It was early produced for a short period of time, nine years, but was quietly used. After World War II, M24 was used in the Korean War and by the French during the First Indochina War and the Republic of Vietnam Army during the Vietnam War. M24s were mostly removed from the US and NATO armies by the 1960s, but remained in service with some third world countries. As a light tank, the M24 Chaffee mainly performed armed reconnaissance and infantry support when required. The M24 Chaffee was designed to replace the M5 Stuart light tank. The tank weighed 18.37 tons, length was 5.56 meters, width was 3 meters, and height was 2.77 meters. It required a crew of five, including commander, gunner, loader, driver, assistant driver, or radio operator. The main weapon of the M24 was a 75mm gun with 48 rounds. Additional weapon was two 0.30 caliber machine gun. One was set next to the main gun, the other at the bow. A 0.50 caliber M2 Browning heavy machine gun could be fitted over the rear, right side of the turret, and operated externally for local air and vehicle defense. A 51mm smoke grenade launching motor was used to provide screening against enemy eyes. M24 Chaffee was equipped with a twin Cadillac series 44T24 engine producing 220 horsepower combined with high dramatic transmission system, 8 forward, 4 reverse speeds. The vehicle can reach a top speed of 56 km per hour, a range of 160 km. On the whole, the M24 Chaffee combines firepower, speed, and agility in a complete battlefield package. Low profile gave the tank good hiding. The 75mm main gun was more efficient than the M5's 37mm. However, the armor was underestimated because it was too thin. It was easily penetrated by most shell propelled anti tank guns and anti tank mines. Like other successful World War II tanks, the M24 was delivered to many countries around the world until it was gradually replaced by the M41 Walker Bulldog. This tank was extremely suitable for dealing with an enemy with poor firepower and lack of anti-tank weapons. Basically, the M24 was able to withstand all types of conventional infantry fire, but it was easily defeated by just a single shot from Bazooka. This tank served for the French army in the First Indochina War from 1945 to 1945.
1954 as American Ed. In December 1953, 10 M24s were mobilized to participate in the Dien Bien Phu campaign. At that time, the M24 Chaffee light tank was decommissioned by the US. These tanks were delivered to France as a way to dispose of obsolete products, an intelligent American attempt. The M24 Chaffees were considered a breakthrough fighter on the battlefield if the Viet Minh dare to attack Dien Bien Phu stronghold deep in the hills of northwestern Vietnam. On December 16, 1953, France launched Operation Rondel 2. Due to the difficult terrain in the mountainous regions of northern Vietnam, the French army had to disassemble the M24 tanks and parachute them into Dien Bien Phu. These tanks were divided into three divisions of the 3rd Company, belonging to the 1st Light Cavalry Regiment. These tanks caused many difficulties and damage to the Vietnamese army. In the Battle of Independence here, on March 15, the French launched a counterattack under the command of Lieutenant Colonel Pierre Longlaires, mobilizing two parachute battalions, a total of 1,000 soldiers, and up to five tanks, but was repelled by artillery. The fate of these 10 light tanks was quite tragic. The Viet Minh was equipped with homemade bazookas. A total of 8 tanks were destroyed. The remaining two were captured by the Viet Minh as booty. According to French statistics, 10 M24s fired a total of 15,000 rounds during the entire the Battle of Dien Bien Phu. In addition to Dien Bien Phu, the French also used many other M24 tanks throughout North Vietnam during the First Indochina War. These tanks were then sent to the south and used in the pattern of the Saigon Army during the Vietnam War. Until the Battle of Hue in 1968, the M24 tanks of the Saigon Army continued to fight and this was the last battle of the M24 Chaffee tanks in the Vietnamese territory. That is the story of the M24 Chaffee tank in the Vietnam battlefield. Do you like this topic? Let me know your opinion in the comments. It will motivate me to make the next videos. Thank you. My video of M24 Chaffee light tank answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Nó, nó, nó hơi vòng sang phía phần đường của mình giật mình